And behind a t-shirt stand is hoping to do more than start a fashion phenomenon. Now, Beth Vaughn takes you to Mound City, Missouri, about an hour and a half north of Kansas City to share his story. So bye-bye, Miss American Pie. Drove my Chevy to the levee, but the levee was dry. An old song making a comeback in Mound City, Missouri, except Bill Hudding has his own version. I drove my Chevy to the levee. I drove my Chevy to the levee and the Corps of Engineers washed it away. A catchy slogan that caught on quickly. It's been fun. It's watching. I mean, I'll go to Kansas City and people wear them in Kansas City. It's crazy. Earlier this summer, Hudding printed 20 t shirts for his close friends. But as the Missouri River grew, so did demand. So this is all medium. Cody Tubbs already bought eight. Today, she came back for more. Got even more shirts for some friends that live up in Lincoln, Nebraska, and they've been seeing people wear them and they wanted them, and so they said mail us up some. It's become a fashion statement in Mound City. Yes. So far, Hudding sold 2,500. Yep. Though he's had plenty of time to brush up on retail this summer. The flood of 2011 cost Hudding a season's worth of business at the Sportsman's Lodge he owns in Bigelow. I'd have to sell a million t-shirts. You know, to make up for what we've lost. If he makes a few bucks, great. But this shirt was meant to be noticed by the Army Corps of Engineers, a group Hudding thinks set up Northwest Missouri for failure. Your house has a possibility of catching on fire and burning. But you don't expect the fire department to come light it on fire. <laughs> and that's kind of what it feels like. In Mound City, Beth Vaughn, NBC Action News. Wow, hunting plans to sell those t-shirts until the demand drops. Very interesting. Yeah, he's, doing well. he's doing making well. the best of it. He has a good sense of humor. Yeah.